Welcome back to Magically Talented Read Alouds. Today we'll be reading The Story Behind Juneteenth by Jack Reader. Here is the table of contents. We'll be reading about June 19th, Slavery in the United States, the Emancipation Proclamation, Juneteenth, a forgotten holiday, celebrating freedom, and on the rise. June 19th, Juneteenth. June 19th is a very important day. It marks the end of slavery in the United States. For a long time, not many people celebrated this historic holiday. It's only recently that more people have started to remember and celebrate Juneteenth again. Slavery in the United States. Ship captains first brought African slaves to North America in the early 1600s. Many slaves were forced to work on large farms in the South. By the 1700s, many people began realizing slavery was bad. By 1804, all the Northern states had started to end slavery. Many people in the North and the South didn't agree about slavery. As more states joined the United States, more people became divided on the issue. The Civil War began in 1861 because of the disagreements between the North and the South. The Emancipation Proclamation President Abraham Lincoln's goal was to keep the United States together. In time, he decided that freeing the slaves would help this goal. In 1863, he issued the Emancipation Proclamation, which freed all slaves in the states controlled by the South. Still, this couldn't be enforced in many places. Juneteenth. News of the Emancipation Proclamation spread slowly through the South. In April 1865, the North won the Civil War. Two months later, African Americans in Texas learned about the proclamation. When they did, on June 19, 1865, they celebrated their freedom. Former slaves and others celebrated Juneteenth, which is short for June 19th, for the first time in 1866. Celebrations soon spread to other states. Traditions, including praying, singing, and wearing new clothes to mark their freedom, soon became part of the holiday for many African Americans. People continue these traditions today. A Forgotten Holiday Even though many African Americans celebrated Juneteenth during the late 1800s, it never became an official holiday in the United States. The years after the Civil War were hard for the states in the South. Few people in power were interested in celebrating the end of slavery. Note, Juneteenth became a federal holiday in 2021 and is celebrated on June 19th. After the war, people disagreed on what to do about former slaves and former slave states. During the early and mid-1900s, white people made many laws to enforce segregation. Former slaves had been freed, but African Americans still had little freedom. Many people forgot about Juneteenth and its meaning. Celebrating Freedom During the 1950s and 1960s, the civil rights movement was growing and segregation started being banned throughout the United States. African Americans began celebrating their freedom again. In 1980, Texas became the first state to make Juneteenth an official holiday. Here 
Here is a look at the glossary of important words that we have encountered throughout the text. This brings us to the end of our read aloud. Thank you for joining us.